Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Kate. And today we're doing another thing in this gym. We are going to Kiliki, but first we're going to stop at Mombasa for today, and then tomorrow we'll go to Kiliki. So I'm super excited for this trip. It's been a while since I've been to SGR. So we're using SGR from Mombasa, and then tomorrow we'll take a bus to Kiliki. I was trying to make it very affordable because you know I like making my own gyms very affordable for you guys. So <laughs> that lady's voice has been so annoying. <laughs> I'm really sorry I didn't close off yesterday's vlog <laughs> but I was so tired I just wanted to relax because hey it was a long journey but we are in Mamboni or oh, Tangi or oh, Tangi we are not Tangi <laughs> I don't know why I keep forgetting the name Eunice was so kind to accommodate us for the night she cooked for us you know she's taking care of us like we are her children you know which is very nice she's here but she's not dressed <laughs> so i really can't show you guys but she was so kind and really appreciate their, their hospitality but now it's time to go to Kalefe. we are about to leave and go to Kilifi, which i'm super excited for we are going to distant relatives i've never been there actually i've never been to Kilifi ever so we are breaking our Kilifi virginity with Hilary. so hopefully it's a nice experience <laughs> We are here in Kilifi at Distant Relatives, Backpackers and Echo Lodge. I am so, so happy that I'm finally here. I can't wait to show you guys what they have to offer. It's so beautiful and it's very affordable and it's totally, totally worth it. I can't wait for you guys to see. So let's see what they have to offer.
it's time to go to the beach let's go let's go get sunburned but I've already put sunscreen please even if you're in Nairobi you need to put sunscreen even if you're dark even if you're dark it's not only for light people everyone needs sunscreen okay put on your sunscreen sign It's day two and we're about to have breakfast and hopefully we'll go for the door cruise, right? Hillary? <laughs> so yeah, I'm super excited for that. I had a good night's sleep. I had a very amazing shower. It was cold, but since it's the result of heat around, you don't really feel how cold it is. And yeah, I'm super excited for the day. So let's see how it goes. Done with breakfast. We were so hungry, even forgot to take footage of the breakfast. But their menu is really, it's big, but it's very affordable. Everything is under a thousand, everything. So now we are going to clean the beach because that's the way we are. Environmentalists, good Kenyans, clean the beach. Stop throwing plastics everywhere. It's ruining our environment. Okay? So let's go clean up after that. Guys, beach cleaning was hey, it was very eye opening. There were a lot of plastic, I don't know, ropes, a lot of bottle tops. Like, what are we doing to our environment, honestly? Like, it's so sad. But I'm happy that this, this alternative is actually every Tuesday is beach cleaning day. So, guests can actually go and clean. Today is actually Saturday, but today was world cleaning day. That's why we're able to do it. Day, which I think it's actually very amazing. Every time you find trash, just pick it up, imagine to take in the right place instead of throwing it in the ocean. So, after all that work, I just want to take a quick swim, <laughs> I relax, and then hopefully, the next time we see each other, we'll be us going to see the sun set. So, I'll see you guys later. Hey guys, so 
we are sailing at the moment, but I've just seen the most beautiful sunset. I'm sure you've seen also how beautiful it is. We are almost like nine here, and we're just enjoying our time. This place is so pretty. If you come to Kilimanjaro, make sure you do the no sailing thing. <laughs> Je ne peux pas. Day 3, our final day. We are actually ready to leave. But this place has been so amazing and it's been so different for us because we usually drive to places. This time we were not driving. It was so weird. And we actually use public transport, which is something I know most people will not do. Coming to Kilifi, you can use flight. I saw Safari Link have like from Wilson to Kilifi, but we decided to use SGR and public transport, literally, which was very affordable and easier than we thought. We actually spent 1600 coming to Kilifi, that is SGR and the Matatus, which I think is a very good deal, right? Instead of paying return flights that will cost like 14, 14,000. And coming here is actually, it's been amazing, you guys. They have so many activities. It's such a beautiful place and it's an eco lodge. So they actually mind the environment. Like the loose, it's like a compost loo. The water is recycled everywhere around as there is no dirt there's no plastic it's just a very a very amazing place there's a swimming pool they have events the beach is just here you can go for a cruise you can go to the village there are so many activities that we wanted to do but because of the limited time we weren't able to do but there are so so many activities if you want to save more money instead of buying at the restaurant you can make your own food which we didn't do that's weird we usually make <laughs> We didn't make our own food, but they have good food. The bar is open from 7 a.m. The bar is open from 7 a.m. <laughs> how, how amazing is that? And I had a dawa. I've been having that dawa. It's so good. I didn't know Kilifi. Their thing was the dawa cocktail. It's been amazing. So I highly, highly recommend this place. I will leave the link down in the description. So please, to see Patani Apoka comments, you will just see how much, the link will be down in the description and you'll see how much the accommodation offers uh, cost because that's we're in a private banda, there are dorms, there are tents, so you can come like a group of people and it's actually really affordable, trust, similar to you. you know me, trust me, this is an amazing place. So if you're ever in Kilifi, make sure you come to the central natives, it is amazing i promise you i promise you so as i said ruby nairobi <sighs> we'll be back we'll definitely be back